Good morning. This keeps getting stuck under my legs and it's driving me nuts. All right. <clears throat> Weekend energy, y'all. Weekend energy. <clears throat> What's that? Pink Panther? All right. <clears throat> Let's do, I don't know, let's do it. The Magician. All right, so fire. Weekend energy. This is a tough deck to shuffle. Weekend energy. Weekend energy. Fire. <clears throat> Three of Wands. Could be waiting. This could represent patience. This could represent your ships being in. Six of Pentacles, which is nice. Um, I, well, okay, not well, that is, okay. This is Aries Leo Sag, okay? So, I just had finding out that was so clear. I don't for your wands, you're finding out. Have you been waiting a while to find out something? I mean, because you're you're about to find out something. This give and take I, is like the like a balance for you guys. Um, but it's it's more than that because it's like it, it's growing. It's like you want it, but it's you can't have it, or it's not time. I, I really hate delivering messages like that. It's like anxiety, you're not sure. Is it time? Is it not time? Interesting. You guys could come across a lizard this weekend. Queen of Cups. You know, this is somebody loving, caring, compassionate, wears a heart on her sleeves. It's, it talks about emotions. It's water. You might need to balance your emotions this weekend. I don't know if you're trying to figure out how to give. We got the moon. What's that saying? To the moon and back, Alice. Son of Alice. Finding out Alice, huh? Hmm. Whatever it is, is whatever you're finding out, because this is finding out, so I don't know what that's forgetting, okay? Um, it, it's definitely emotional. Knight of Wands. So you got a messenger here coming right at, you know, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. You got two cards of water. And then you got the fire. So it's like fire is coming at water. So you have a message that's emotional. I don't know if it talks about a delay, if it talks about your future, because this card can represent both. It could talk about distance. I don't really see distance here. Um... A lot of galactic energy here, so I'm not sure where that's coming from. I don't see any sexual energy here, but the song that just came to me is, um, but what is it? Bodies, you got the perfect one, so put it on me. <laughs> there's there's no way you're getting anything right there. Um, cause it's almost like 
this knight of wands is all armored up okay and the dragon looks pissed i don't know if you found out or you're gonna find out that somebody was giving to someone else like there's something and i don't read these cards reversed and ironically enough i don't know if you noticed the moon actually came out reversed which is confirming that you're gonna find something out that's a given i didn't even pick up on that until now that's a confirmation for me i've, I've never heard something so clear like that and it's like i can't explain it i didn't hear it it's just there it's, it's in my head it's not a voice i hear in my ear it's this knowledge that's stored in my head something I can't explain it I can't explain it myself it's just a gift sometimes it could be like what the fuck it's like the devil and the angel on the shoulders you know so something is, is definitely being revealed and then you got the ten of pentacles Okay, so there could be a family situation going on here. It um, could be long term. It could be longevity. But with the Ten of Pentacles, you got the Ten of Swords. So this is an ending. And then you have Strength, which is representing courage. Okay, and there's some sorrow here. And then the Five of Pentacles. Yeah, so there, I mean... There's definitely an ending. It's almost like have the courage to go after love. Have the courage to do something. Because it's like looking in this direction. So I don't know if there's a little fear here about getting into something long term. There definitely needs to be some courage. Bodies. You got the perfect one, so put it on me. <laughs> and there's nothing sexual here, so I don't know what that's about. I mean, the, the Knight of Wands can be sexual, but this moon, whomever this is, is like, yeah, right. It's that it's it's something so emotional. So I, I don't I don't know where someone's head is. Um Again with this lizard, I don't know what that is. You might come across a lizard, salamander. Your kid can be in the backyard and like, look what I found. I guess it depends on where you live. I mean, in my backyard there was always salamanders, but they're you know they're rare and they're going extinct. So, I mean, we live in a there's a pond behind my yard, so we get all that type of stuff. We actually have like flowers that are ex ex um, going extinct, like lady slippers so i don't know what type of environment you guys are in but like if you're in that type of like wetlands maybe um you might come across something because something like it's, it's growing i don't you're hesitant yes it's, it's like you don't know and then it's this is like um i'm thinking pavati which is ganesha's mother and I, I normally don't pick that up like that at all, which is very random that I would pick up on something like that. Let me see if I can find the image that I'm seeing because I don't know why on earth I would be picking up on that image with this book with the two totally different vibes. I think it's just the arms. Card meanings. I'm trying to find the image. I just, just real quick, cause that's a message for you. Here's all the arms too. Talks about protection, vibration, frequency, clearing your energy. There's nothing here saying you gotta clear your energy. I mean, you always want to do that too, right? But this one talks about Pavati's mother. It's 
So put it on me. You got the perfect thing. Oh, am I thinking Shivra? What's Pavati? I was thinking Ship Shipra. Who's Pavati? Okay, that's weird. I mean, some of you guys might know. And I'm assuming it's Hinduism. Who, what is Pavati in Hinduism? It's not Burma. So see, here I am making up words. If somebody knows what I'm talking about, will you please comment? Because apparently I don't know what I'm talking about. I mean, so they're saying I do know what I'm talking about, but I, I don't. So I don't know what that's about. It's strange. Um, It's definitely a Hindu thing. Well, maybe it's not. How would I spell that? Maybe it's a Greek thing? Pavati. It's spelling provide, so I don't even know how it's spell it. Capital of Arizona. To cause to deal to damage. Cause all I got is Pavati. I don't know what the fig that means. To do something to cause damage, trouble, inconvenience. Pretend fake. So you're dealing with someone fake this weekend. This energy is like pretending. It could be for money reasons, family situations, because something's over. So you have an energy that's pretending to want to give, to pretend to want to have a future. Okay, so there's that. The meaning of Pavati. How popular is a baby's name Pavati? Land, origin, how to pronounce Pavati. Slovenian. The Slovenian. I don't know if you're dealing with Croatian. I don't, I don't know what. Pavati in English. Through example, translation into sentences. Listen, punch, run, grammar. All right, troops. So you're dealing with Pavati. Uh, somebody who right now is, is more damage and trouble and inconvenience than anything. Okay. And that's exactly how I was trying to spell it. That's so you're dealing with okay. So you're dealing with it's not even Hinduism, it's Slavani, Slavanian, whatever. It's like baklava, which is what Greek? Is that I don't even freaking know. Well, I know that's Greek. I, pff, Pavati, huh? Jeez. Okay, so you're dealing with somebody who's fake, and I got goosebumps, so that's confirmation, okay? So you have a queen of cups that's acting like they want something here. So to me, with the three of swords, strength, this is like having the courage. Yeah, it's going to hurt somebody, but it's like time to go with the eight of wands. Like, got to go, you know? So, so you're finding out 
Okay, so those were very two clear messages. You're finding out and then Pavati. So, and this was reversed. So it is extra confirmation, guys. I'm sorry it took me so long to, to do that. Um, for you, it's just the way it hits, okay? And there's this lizard thing too. I don't know what that's about. But that's like confirmation. But this, see, this is angry energy. Like this Knight of Wands usually doesn't come in angry like that. But this is like somebody who's got it. See, I did not want to clarify these at all. I was going to in the extended, okay? But I will clarify the intentions of this Knight of Wands. Well, regardless, whatever this is, is extremely heavy um, for the Knight of Wands. Maybe the Knight of Wands got to tell somebody something. This deck feels really small right now. Oh, because I was just working with the big one. And then the Two of Swords reverse. So this is somebody who's extremely indecisive, not knowing what to do, but not wanting to be in the energy of the Five of Cups either. So I will do one clarification for the Queen of Cups here. And then I'm going to do a little extended on Patreon for everybody because I told them that I would do something for them today. So tell me about this Queen of Cups. So right now you're dealing with somebody who's fake and this is somebody in your family. It's Ten of Pens talks about family work, Ten of Swords feeling stabbed in the back, but it's it's like controlling energy or just um it's like um look at all the arms like all I, I don't even know how else to explain it. Come on. Tell me about this Queen of Cups. Seduction. Third party interference, attraction, dating, flirting, hooking up. This this could be a hookup if you're dating for damn sure. So put it on me. All right, so now, now I see it. I didn't see it. Because this is dating. This could be out and about. You could be traveling. This is somebody who likes to hook up. But the more the story, this is like this is like finding out something being revealed. Like this is over. So the the story is bigger than just like hooking up. To me, this is probably just third party interference because I don't see temptation. I don't see anything else. Not with this energy. Okay, so you are dealing with somebody who is is interfering because there's there's just interference. But please know, it's linked to Pentacles, so I don't know if this is like regarding, there's a situation here regarding money. There's something with fraud, fraudulent activity, fraud, something with fraud here. I don't know where the fuck that just came from. Someone did something illegal or something. Or someone might do something illegal over the weekends. And it's surrounded by money. So I... Watch out for pickpocketers this weekend. That's more like um, you're traveling. But no, this is something fraudulent here. Again, Queen of Cups, Queen of Cups. This is... Okay, Queen of Cups being... Confirmed with the Queen of Cups. I don't know. I just saw Five of Swords. I don't know if you're going to find out this one did something fraudulent in the past. What is that all about? In order to have like a new start or something? Look at looking right at the money. Did you invest overseas? What is this? So put it on me. You got the perfect one. Mm -hmm. All right. So it's not. There's so it's watching it. So one strength messages. It's, it's kind of like all the same stuff down there. Moving forward. Okay. So it's not really telling me. That's a message for somebody. I, I don't know. Watch your wallet so this you might find out. I don't think you're going to find out about fraud per se. There's something here of fraud. So it's forgetting somebody on the board. All right. So the, at the end of the day, guys, 
there's, there's third party interference, whether this is an ex, whether it's a boss, whether it's somebody you're with, like however it goes, okay? Something is about to be revealed. It's, it's just that simple. There is hesitation here though, but there's an energy that's like all armed up. Something's definitely over. This is like holding it to 10. You held on to it for too long. Like it's, this is like, gotta go. Gotta have the courage to go. Gotta go. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go right now. Gotta go, gotta go, 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 go. Eight of Swords. Seven of Cups. Seven of High Priestess. Seven of Swords. Another seven. Yeah, see, there's something going on. Some type of secret. Eight of Swords. Trap. I don't know. Somebody might get caught up. So put it on me. You got the perfect one. You got to be stronger. You got to be strong and, and push through this. Whatever this is, this is talks about strength and pushing through. So I guess that would be like the right type of energy to do that. It's like, it's it's got to come out. It's got to be confronted. Like the longer you postpone or avoid, the longer it's, it's going to take. Like the harder it's going to get. And again, Pavati, you're dealing with somebody who's being fake this weekend and all for the wrong reasons. What was it? Fake and, um, what was it? To cause, deal, damage, trouble, inconvenience. You're dealing with somebody, I, I don't know if there's a money situation, there's something going on with money or giving. Or I'll pretend I didn't see that. You know what I mean? Like, it's just somebody who, like, wants the upper hands here. I don't know if you're trying to make her or him happy. It's, it's like you're dancing around this one for a certain reason. It's like knowing that you don't even want to be in this situation. You're dancing around her at a, for a convenience. And she's doing something too. So this it, this is caution for you guys. It's kind of controlling, but not controlling like that. It, it's somebody who wants the upper hand. Somebody who is, has like is, is like drama. There's drama attached to this one. It's like, look at all the tricks up her sleeve. She's got six hands. Like this one, I'm telling you, like, see, kind of hands. Risk, not showing their hands. Gambling. Karmic relationship. All right, best of luck, Trooper Loops. That's all I'm doing. I'm going to do the extended. So if everyone who's not on Patreon, I'm just telling you, like, you're going to find out or you're dealing with somebody who's going to find out something. It's confirmation. It's getting revealed. Not really sure what this is regarding. Could it be fraud? Could it be money? Could it be just finding out something, seeing something? Like, there's something. It's not really telling me what it is. It's, it's definitely an ending. Okay? Um, this is somebody who's interfering in something. This is, it, it's like weighing on you. Like, um, how do I, how else do I put it? it it's, it's just he or she, it's coming in as a, a feminine, is a lot of work, emotional. It's like fake. Fake this, fake that. Like, you're dealing with somebody who knows exactly what they're doing. And they got six fucking hands, okay? So, I I don't know if you just don't want to see it. Or they don't want to see it. Okay, so... <laughs> that sucks ass. That is for sure. Not showing their hand, being strategic. Yeah, well, this chick's got six right now, okay? So, there's resentment coming from this energy. It's almost like this energy has stabbed you in the back over and over with something. Like, you can't win with this energy. But yet, you still try to... It's like kosher energy, but you don't need to be kosher. Like, if you're doing the right thing, karmically, you, you don't... You know what I'm saying? Like, self-worth is key. I almost feel like you're doing something in a way to, to make it easier on everybody. And it's, it's like, nah, because this one has ill intent anyway. Pavati, huh? Hmm. Well, look at that. All right, y'all. See you on Patreon.
Have a kick-ass weekend. I feel like... No, I summed a lot up. I mean, there's not a lot, but I mean, it's a lot. Be careful if you're having like a one-night stand or a temptation or flirting or hooking up. Because you're going to be hooking up with somebody that is like in the midst of drama. Okay, so don't get caught up in that shit either. I mean, again, it could just be vacation. We are away for the weekend, hooking up. But just, you know, if you're going to do that, be safe because I don't know if everyone's sleeping with everybody. It doesn't look that way. But I, it, I would just like whomever, you know, sexual activity, it, it exchanges energy, guys. And I, this is not the type of energy I'd want floating around in, in my DNA. I'll tell you that. So best of luck there. Be extremely cautious. If you're entertaining this weekend, because this, there's somebody around you fake as fuck. Love you guys.